Hello everyone, my name is iTrooper and welcome back to another video. Today I'm showing you guys how to install Police Menu version 1.0.4 into your LSVDFR. This is a really, really new mod and it's currently number one trending on LSVDFR. And to be honest, this is the most innovative mod we've had on LSVDFR in a long ass time. So this is definitely a mod I'd recommend installing. So do not skip, I'd really recommend installing this mod. The first thing you guys are going to do to install this is click the first download link down in the description below. Head up here and then click download this file. Agree and download and install the latest version available to you. Click here and then wait for it to download. Once it's done, open it on up and then go into the Grand Theft Auto V folder and you should be able to see here you have your basic plugins file. So to install this, what you guys want to do is navigate to your GTA 5 main directory. So as always, those of you guys on Epic Games and Rockstar Games, your GTA 5 main directory and how to get to it will be down in the description below. But for those guys on Steam, I'm going to show you guys how to get to that right now. So to do that, what you guys want to do, go to whatever drive your Steam is installed on, program files 86, then find Steam, and then go to Steam Apps, and then Common. And that is where your GTA 5 main directory will be. Unless you have it under a custom directory like me, which is just on a different drive, and minus the program files 86. Once you've got your GTA 5 modded files up, grab your plugins folder and simply drag and drop it to the side, making sure it doesn't go in any folders by accident. Drag and drop it into your game, and now if you go into plugins and LSVDFR, you should be able to see here that your police menu is successfully installed. Leave this open, because I'm going to show you guys how to sort this out right here, which is your configuration settings and your INI which has got all your different settings in it, but go back on your download and go into the OpenIV folder. So you should be able to see here, you have a YTD and a GFX. So to install this, what you guys are gonna wanna do is simply open up your OpenIV. If it will work, there it is, open up your OpenIV. And from here, what you guys are gonna wanna do is you are going to want to select Windows, and then you guys are going to want to go to the following path file. So you're going to want to go to your mods folder and then go to update and then go to update.rpf and then x64 and then data and then CD images and then scale form generic dot rpf or scale form underscore generic dot rpf. And from here, what you guys want to do is go into edit mode in the top right hand corner. Make sure all your ASI tools are installed and are green like so. Grab these files and really simply drag and drop them into your game. And just like that, really, really easily, we have now installed the police menu. As I said, to install this and to configure everything, I am going to show you guys quickly what this does right here. This is your configuration settings. This is basically all the settings of a mod. You can open it with Notepad or Notepad++ or whatever you prefer. I usually use Notepad++. And here there's a couple of settings you can change, such as your key bindings, which is pretty simple. There's no numbers that you have to know. So your key bindings is literally just the key, which is really nice. So here are all your key bindings if you're not sure how to open it. And this is all your clothing. You can change this if you want by going through your trainer menu and seeing what numbers they are or using your EUP. But other than that, I hope you guys did find this video useful. If you did, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out the mod creator and give him some well-deserved love and support. Check out my Discord server and my Patreon down in the description below if you want to support the channel further and also the channel sponsors at posting for all your server hosting needs and use the code Highway Trooper, no capitals or spaces for 20% off all of their servers and pretty much every product on their website. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers and goodbye.